I know you can't probably see the shirt or smell it, but this shirt smells so fucking good. I mean, it smells good. I just picked it up and it smells so fucking good. Just for the record, I do not use Axe Body Spray because I'm not a douchebag. That's a douchebag thing? When did that become a douchebag thing? <laughs> What's up YouTube, Wildboy here, and welcome to this. Now, it's been a minute since I talked about this topic. As many of you guys know, I've been waiting for the game Honey Pop 2 for like two and a half, two and a half, three years, and I've kept quiet about it, trying to keep, trying to stay away from stuff on it, but I've seen a tweet that was posted on December 23rd that the game was three weeks away from being finished, and that some uh, some game footage has been leaked with more voice acting and all that, and they put Honey, Honey Q or Honey Dev posted on Twitter, Yesterday or early this morning, I checked at the day that Honey Pop 2 was now wishlist on Steam, so I put it on my wish list. And I told myself I was not going to do this, but I kept away from hearing. For some reason, I kept been I kept away from hearing what the voice actresses looked like. I told myself I'll hear the voice ex actresses for the first time when I play this game. And I thought, you know what? I mean, I've heard I've heard, I heard a lot of things that the that Honey Dev or Ryan Coons has meant has done vo recast the thing behind voice actors' backs, have recast and vo recast the voices on many characters and all that. I saw that some of the characters were the same from Honey Camp Studio. I know that the voice actors for Jesse stepped down, and the, I don't know which one. The voice act, the original voice actors for Candace got stepped down, down, but she came back to role, came back to the role or something like that. And I don't know the whole story. I kept away from it. A lot of this stuff happened on the Discord. The Honey Pop Discord server, which I want to say I can't see because I got banned for joining too many times. But at the end of the day, I'm still going to play the Honey Pop 2 again when it comes out. So it said, it said the recent tweet has said they're still aiming before Valentine's Day, so it could be on Valentine's Day or a week or two before then. They, are, they posted Honey Dev, like I said, there's a new updated trailer on the scene, a bunch of the same stuff with new dialogue on there. And I told myself I wasn't going to do this. To hear the voice acting, and I said, you know what, fuck the waiting, I want to see what the game and hear what the voices look like before I play the game, because I was thoroughly impressed with the gameplay trailer, which is actually this day, the damn recording was uploaded a year ago today, so, I've told myself, like I said many times, I told myself that I wasn't going to hear the voice acting, to hear the voice for the first time until the game, but I want to see a preview of the game, I told myself I was not going to see previews of the game, I watched, I watched these clips a couple of times, so there's, for the looks of it, there's three 30 to 45 seconds, I got two videos, one video is... 30 is 40 seconds, one video is 45, so basically up to 40 to 45 seconds of gameplay trailer trailers, and, well, there's a, there's a couple of ones, but I wanted to give my reaction to, um, the voice acting for the first time, and to give you my thoughts on it with the new voice, I know the voice character for Ashley, a lot of people were pissed off because the Kenny Dev went and recast her, and people liked the original voice actors, and she's British, I'm not 100% sure, but I'm gonna react to the, react to this, react to these videos, so, I'm going to do it on my phone because my computer's slow as shit. So, anyway, first one we're going to be at, this is coming from the, ch this is coming from the channel, this is coming from the channel, Kayla, uh, Kayla, K K Kip, Kayla, if you want to check out the videos, I will put the videos down in the description. Anyway, I'm actually excited for this, this one is Honey Pop, the first one, Honey Pop 2, get, Tez gameplay trailers, and from the looks of it, you got, uh, let me, sh I'll show, you'll see a clip above, on the boat there, and it shows a clip of, it shows Candace and Lailani, which is Candace is the stripper, and Lailani is the Asian chick, so, we're gonna take a look at this, it's got, it's got a whole lot of likes, so, I'm kind of nervous about this, but I'm excited, so, anyway, I got it on my phone right here, we're ready to go, here are the previews, this is 45, 46 seconds long, enough chit chat, here we go. Damn it. Yeehaw. Okay, so Candace got a southern accent. Okay. A lot of, uh, of kind of, kind of high pitch. Who are you guys? Okay, so I got mixed feelings about it. Uh, Lailani, I, Lailani, I think she's voiced, I, I'm going to have to go back and do my research, that she's voiced by the same person who did her in Honey Camp Studio. I can hear the resemblance in it. And then, the diff well, in Honey Camp Studio, I didn't even hear the, the southern accent 
in Candace, which each, each character had like four to five lines. I don't know how, how many lines they had. So Candace is a stripper, obviously. She sounds south, she's southerner, so I'm assuming she's from Texas. <laughs> um, but I mean, it's good. It's good. I mean, I, I like the voices. I like lately Lilani's high pitched voice or something about that makes it adorable. Kind of reminds me of the character Alex from Totally Spies when Katie Griffin voices her, her makes it more high pitched, more adorable. When I see girls or when I like voice actors, like I said, a lot of people ask me when Totally Spies when I hear. If I prefer Katie Lee, the original voice actress is Alex and Totally Spies over Katie Griffin. I prefer, I prefer Crazy Towns. I both actresses do a fine job voicing her. I prefer Katie Griffin over Katie Lee voicing Alex because the way she does the high pitched voice, like like it does for Lonnie, makes it more adorable, adorable. And I find it more adorable when you get shy or girls with high pitched voices. I don't know. There's something about girls that I like with high pitched voices. I always thought they were annoying. I always thought they were going to be annoying, but I always liked them. All right. So this next one, I don't know which one I want to do. This one, the next one I got is this one with Ash. Where'd it go? I lost it. Shit. Okay, so let me click back on the video. Where'd it go? There's okay. There's the test gameplay. Got it up. Okay, so the next one we're gonna be Watch Two is called Honey Pop Two. More combos uploaded by the same person. And this one you got uh, Ashley and you got uh, Nora. And come the, and Nora, Nora, her name's Nora Del Rio. She's related to Kiana Del Rio, which is probably my probably one of my favorite Honey Pop characters. I honestly haven't thought about having a favorite or not. So this one, I'm assuming this is gonna be with the new voice actors. I have not heard the original voice actors. I was gonna watch the original the voice cast, and it was uploaded two years ago. I said screw it because that's just a bunch of that. A lot of that has been recast. So this next one is Honey Pop Two More Combos. It has Nora and. Ashley, so I'm assuming people are reading the comments, and there's a lot of mixed feelings. The original voice actress did comment on it, and the British, she has British accent, it's quiet either way. So, uh, Nora sounds sexy, so I'm looking forward to this. So, here we go, clip number two. Here we go. Well, clip number two, let's do it. Hey, sick, all tattoo. Okay. Nora, is that your girlfriend's name or something? That's Nora's. Oh, that I can tell that's Nora's original voice actress. That's the original. I like her voice. I like the voice actress for Nora. Okay, so that one's not too bad. I didn't hear the original. I do like the British, because um, with the original Honey Pop, you hear a lot of uh, American accents, but this is the one where you hear where Ashley has a British accent. Obviously, she said the C word, which is my least favorite word of all time. Uh, Nora Del Rio's voice, voice acting, voice actor sound is the same person. I can tell that's the same voice actor for Honey Pop 2, and that's what I like. Her voice is absolutely fucking amazing. The worst one I've seen so far. So, here we got clip number three. This one has... <coughs> This one has Polly and Brooke, and I made a video about a year ago that that uh, the nostalgia critic reacts to the character Polly, and cute and crit nostalgia critic gets all excited until she find that he finds out that Polly has a dick, which apparently was supposed, to, which obviously makes a transgender character who has not had the full sex operation. So I don't know if it's female to male or male to female. I'm not 100 percent sure, but apparently I've seen that got a lot of controversy. And Honey Steps said, "Okay, so we'll make it optional. We can make her make her transgender, or we can just make her with a be a girl from birth." So anyway, I'm reading the comments for this one. Honey, Honey Pop Two conversation with Polly and Brooke, and people are saying that Brooke sounds like Ico, and Polly sounds like Harley, Harley Quinn with a New Jersey accent. Which, first off, I love Harley Quinn. Uh, Arlene Sorkin plays the best Harley Quinn from Batman of the Animated Series, and you can't change my fucking mind about that. But we're gonna hear this is the last video, and I will give you my thoughts on this one as well. So this is like I said, this is the pop, the honey pop, pop. This is the honey pop two conversation with Brick and Polly. So turn up the volume. Let's hear it. Let's do it. Oh, you married? Oh, lucky you! I'm still searching for my special someone. Okay, that voice is good. That's Take good. From someone who's been married three times, it's not all it's cracked up to be. She does not sound like Ico. Uh, what happened with your previous marriages? I found somebody with more, well, let's just say, more to offer. He's a gold digging whore! What's your rush? You're young, beautiful, and successful. I trade places with you in an instant. You're still hot, though. I don't know. I just love the idea of being a cute little housewife for my future hubby. <sighs> to be so naive and idealistic again.
Perfect. Okay. So I disagree with a book sounding like Polly. Uh, not Polly. Sounding like fucking Ico. But I do love Polly's accent. I don't hear the Harley Quinn in it, but I can tell she's from up from the New York area, uh, the New Jersey area. I want to say New Jersey or something. So I'm curious to hear what the other voice actors. I know there's another character. I know that Sarah, the chubby weeaboo, is voiced by the same actress who played Nikki, and I th think. Lilani is voiced by the same actress who play, is played who did Celeste, so I don't know about that. So I'm gonna, so I'm not gonna do that. So those are my first impressions of the honey pop, of those honey pop clips, and all I can say is it's really good. I do. I've had to say which one's my favorite voice from a, from the characters. I would obviously say Nora because I because one she's voiced by the same her original voice actor from Honey Cam Studio. You only got like four or five lines from each character from Honey Cam Studio. But the way when you hear more dialogue, her voice is really really cool. Uh, obviously, my second favorite will probably have to be La, uh, Lailani. Heard like I said, I talked about the high pitch pitch high pitch is really more adorable for that. And I got and then I probably would be Polly. Polly, I uh, like the New Jersey accent as well. I've done I've never done reviews on voices, so forgive me. And uh, I would have to say I can understand why people are mad about the. Uh, we're mad about uh, Ashley's voice actor. I, I, I dig, I fucks with the voice, British voice actor, something, something we haven't seen in Honey Pop, Honey Pop 2. So, looking forward to, looking forward to hearing, seeing that. I'm looking for, and what else? We have not here, I know, uh, we have not, we don't have any clips with the original, with the new voice actors for Jesse. I'm not going to watch any clips with Lola because she's voiced by the same, same voice actress. Uh, we haven't got clips for the other characters as well. I can't think of them all off the top of my head. But from the looks of it, I'm impressed. I'm pleased with them. I'm looking forward to the game. Like I said, you can buy Honey Pop. Not buy Honey Pop 2. It's not out yet. But the wish thing, it's on It's on Steam. You can buy it on, wish list, on the wish You can put it on your wish list. I have the same uh, Same with Emily's Away 3. That I put that on my wish list two years ago. And, and, la and there has not been a new updated trailer yet. So I don't even know when that game's going to come out. But I'm really glad with the progress so far. I got a feeling um, we're closer to this game than we were a long time ago. I was hoping. Because I told myself at the end of 2019, I'm hoping. Pop 2 comes out in 2020. If not, I'm going to be very, very disappointed. And we're two weeks into 2021, and from the looks of it, it's going to be out before Valentine's Day. I'm hoping he said, they said, if all things go as planned, it will be out before Valentine's Day. And the Leeson tweet said it was still aiming before Valentine's Day, so it could be sometime at the end of this month, or at, right in between, at the beginning of February. So anyway, what do you guys think of the voice actors? If you want to check out the original videos yourself, I obviously played, put the clip up on the video, and I will put the, and I'll put the clips in the description down below. So, that's enough of that video, enough of the Indian video. Thank you guys a lot for watching. Rate, comment, subscribe, check out my social medias down below. As always, thank you guys a lot for watching. I'll see you all in the future video. Take it easy.